glorious morning. Makes me sick. His punishment shall not be to die, but to live forever with his guilt. As white when he is white, jump back. Twist the bones and then the back. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you are a big fan of Hocus Pocus like I am, then you already know what today's video is about. Uh, this is a continuation with my Halloween series. Today we are doing Winifred Sanderson from Hocus Pocus. I am so excited to do this because I love Hocus Pocus so much. It is a must watch every single year. My kids love it. I love it. And it's just a really fun time. So I really wanted to start with Winifred. She is a little bit more the difficult of the three to do. So I thought it would be really fun to do maybe Winnie this year, Mary next year, and Sarah the year after. So we'll see how that goes. But if you guys want to see how I created this look, then just keep watching. Okay, so I know I look kind of weird. Okay, very weird. I went ahead and covered my eyebrows as much as possible. I will have all those tutorials linked down below because it is a process. And when I say it is a process, it is like no joke. My eyebrow hairs are very, very long. They are dark. So it does take a long time to cover my eyebrows. So I went ahead and skipped that part. However, um, we are going to go ahead and put on uh, primer and foundation. So now I have my foundation on, my eyebrows are done. Uh, we're going to go ahead and move on to eyes. Now, Winifred Sanderson does not have a glamorous eye look. I did notice like a little bit, kind of like an orangey peach tone to it. We're going to take the Soft Glam palette and the first shade we're going to do is we're going to do Burnt Orange and we're going to put that all along our crease color. Okay, so I definitely made that a lot darker than I normally would. Um, so next I'm going to get another fluffy brush and we're going to go into Rustic, this color right here. And we are actually going to put that all over our lid and a little bit into the crease.
so next taking um, kind of just a flatter blending brush and we're gonna go into a cypress umber and work that into our outer corner So Winnie actually does not have very much on her lower lash line. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a flat shader brush and I'm going to go in with um, Rustic and put that on our lower lash line. I'm going to keep it really, really small. go in with some uh, Too Faced sketch marker and we're going to do our top um, top eyeliner. Next, I'm going to go in with some Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On, and we are going to put this on our lower lash line. Now, we are not going to bring it all the way across. She does not have eyeliner all the way across. She kind of has it just on the outer corner, and it, we're going to smudge it out just a little bit. Okay, so we are going to bring just a little bit of contour to the cheeks, not anything too crazy. So I'm going to take my Tarte Clay Play palette and I'm just going to bring in some desert. Now, as we all know, Winifred Sanderson has some crazy rosy cheeks. In this picture, with the reference that I'm going by, they're a little bit more peachy, like a peachy pink. So, let's see what I got here. So, I think I'm going to use, this is one of my Tarte Christmas wheels that I had gotten. And um, I think I'm going to use the one from in here. I think that'll work. So, let's see. I need like a stiff round brush and we're just going to pack that on. All right, I'm going to make that a little bit more pink. So I'm going to go in with this darker shade right here. doesn't have to be a perfect circle hers definitely wasn't so all right so I'm gonna put a little bit of concealer on the lips Ugh, this sucks because my lips stay dry so I'm gonna, like I said just a tiny bit So while I let that dry up, we're going to go back in with our lashes and I'm going to use my Tarte's Lights Camera Lashes Mascara.
Okay, for our lower lash line, I'm going to go in with the NYX Professional Eyeliner. This is just in a brown color. Alright, so I'm going to align my lips with the NYX Lip Liner. And this is in the shade Red Tape. You know, Winnie has that crazy, kind of like almost heart looking lip shape and I don't want to go in with just a liquid lip because I would kind of get that all over the place so we're just going to line that out. Alright so now I have that lined I can go in with my red lipstick and this is in the color Lady Balls from Too Faced. And then you want to line your lips up and make sure that they match up. <laughs> All right, so next is the wig. So I will be right back. All right, guys, so that is it for Winifred Sanderson. Uh, I hope you really like this tutorial. I hope you like the way that this look turned out. I think this represents her very, very well. Um, it was so much fun to create. I was looking forward to this, and I cannot believe that it's finally here. Yes. <laughs> so uh, if you guys did like this tutorial, please give it a big old thumbs up for me. I would greatly appreciate it, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye. Bings, welcome. <laughs> then just keep watching. Then just keep watching. I put a pen on you. There are not enough children in the world to make thee young and beautiful. Hi. Uh-oh. Sisters, did you hear what he called you? Oh, you want to hear your